He's deep there, let's go. Here we pay People sleep on battle styles. It's $100 a box, too. Beautiful stuff. Alright, so. It's the other way. The front is how that's going to be. Okay. So, there. One, two, three to the front. Yeah, there's no. Fire. All right. Let's get that. Grum pig, energy recycler. Ooh, okay. Burst Esper. Ooh. A full art cricket team V. That is Ooh. actually sick. That card is super good. Oh, that is that the hollows are just so clean. Exciting All stage, right. really good ability. There we go. Sick card, dude. Sick pull. Blue energy. Cac turn. Rapid strike energy. XP share. Carcoal. And ooh, ooh. the rapid striker super V. Not bad. Ooh. Two hits back to back. Not bad. Not bad. Then I'll turn a a short for one of the uh, the better pulls in the pack. True. Yeah. That first pack. This is a good one so far. Pretty good be. Really good card. It's the first time, like every deck. Right. Any deck can run it. You That's run, nice. Run, so it's a staple. Out. Yeah. Yeah. So green code cards usually mean a heater, I think, or maybe it was white. I think it was the green. So maybe blue energy. Maybe you're setting up for a third heater. Conkle door. Whoa. Whoa. Wait, where, where's my... Yes, that's, that's... Okay, gotcha. Okay, no, no, I got hear you. I was like, I was like, I was, I was like, mm. Not as great. Not as great. That's, uh, we but, both rare. But we still got plenty to go. Plenty of juice. Plenty of juice to go. Bow styles slept on set. Get them while they're still printing. <laughs> I'm telling you, exactly. People are joking out hard about Like, I would I'm honestly, like, I'd probably buy a box of this just to hold on to for the sheer fact that I know it's going to be value. I know people are probably doing that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Liquor. Ooh, it's Ooh, that one V, okay. Not bad. Three hits so far, but not bad, dude. You got the good side of this box. <laughs> I still got the rest of the box. No, seriously. <laughs> dude, 19 packs total. This is like half the box, yeah. Yeah. Know. Yeah, yeah no, I'm at 36 packs box. So yeah, 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 yeah. I got a good amount of it. Yeah, good amount. Now I have to get into uh, some Yu Gi Oh product. Fact, fact. I know just the man to, to tell me what to go into. Justin's pretty good about the, uh, the Yu Gi Oh scene. True, true. Dude, I want to get more Digimon card game product because, like, the new stuff, like, mm -hmm. coming out in a few months, the alt arts are just so pretty looking, dude. They're just so. Ooh, look so at that Linky Tongue. Drampa. I see that fool all the time.
reverse there. It's not bad though. M4, okay. I think Minsha is actually a pretty decent card. All I know is I want to get the uh, the most rare version of Cyndaquil possible. Um, there probably isn't a very rare Cyndaquil. Well, I know there isn't, but... <laughs> only a PSA 10 from, like, Neo or something. Right. That could be considered the rarest, maybe. Yeah. I mean, are there... What about variants of, like, so, like, Typhlosion and, and oh, Quilava? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, that that would be... Because, like, that was, that was my heater uh, Pokemon. My favorite Pokemon in existence is always going to be... The Cyndaquil uh, line. of a evolution line, mm -hmm. um, just because it's it's, I don't know. It just I played the original generation one games and they were great, but I was young, so yeah. like I didn't start appreciating Pokemon until Gen two came out. And yeah. boy, I tell you, Gen two. Ooh, ooh is a, that's a ooh. good reverse guy. It's a really good card. Nice. He's really, he's really used in the single strike decks. Right. But uh. Yeah, no. So the and the the cool part about that was is um, it it was one of those like Pokemon. It's like in Gen two, your your opponent obviously picks the opposite Pokemon yeah. of you. And the cool part about Typhlosion is that he can learn the punch moves because the the oh, fighting yeah. style moves became relevant in Gen two, um, because you had like Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, stuff like that, and like those Pokemon. Uh, their moves like you got you got way more moves in the second gen because they're like okay cool we have the original move set and then we have like the 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 new moves they put in so you're able to types too. yeah and then you were able to get the different types of punches so even though uh Typhlosion was a fire Pokemon he could learn Thunder Punch true yeah. which was hot since your uh your uh, um your rival would pick um Totodile so eventually it would turn into uh Croconaw and then um. Uh, so on and so forth. So it being a water type, it was very um, weak to Thunder Punch. So Typhlosion was the, the only one in the set of the three that actually was able to learn a counter ability for the rival. You could find, like, alter, alternate types of uh, of uh, moves that could, like, help you. But, ooh, okay, so Mr. Mime. Nice. Another Drampa. Um, but when it came to the, the pair, Typhlosion... Was able because your rival is supposed to be one of the hardest people to beat in the game at later levels, right. and Gen Two uh, gave it to the point where you're actually able to um, re rematch trainers because they would you would oh, add, yeah. you would add them to your cell phone list. Yeah, and you, but like, you could, call them. Mm -hmm. they didn't call you and say when they're ready to battle. Yep, them. and each one they always had the different they always had the same type of Pokemon that they had when you originally engaged them. It was like a little bit stronger, but they're a little bit stronger, or they would get evolution. So like if they oh, ran right, like right. Voltorbs, they would turn into Electrodes. So what was cool about that was that was like how you farmed money in the game was you right. went and you collected the cell phone numbers of people that had types against your your starters. So like I would always pick bug types when I was running a uh, Cyndaquil because then I would just go in and type Lotion would stomp the entire person no matter how strong they got. So that being said, like, you know, there was there was like metas to like grinding in that game. True. And then you got as much money as you could and you would buy that slow poke tail that was worth a million dollars and stuff like that. So that was how you would like get that much money really quickly. Yeah, right. But yeah, that That's that a, that generation. Mhm. Mm I just fight it over and over again. Oh yeah. I don't have the patience for that anymore, man. I I, I just restarted Pokémon Sword and I'm trying to like get into it again. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Flap will be max. Fucking. Skeeter. Yeah. I saw the the shiny Cheryl. I was like, okay, shiny trainer. And then trainer, I was, yeah. and yeah, then I was like, trainer, ooh, yeah. Flappy V Max. God damn. Beautiful. Gorgeous card. Halfway yeah, through. Yeah, he's a Gigantamax. So some of these are Max, they're Dynamax, so it's like Gigantamax. Mm -hmm. Not all Pokemon have a Gigantamax form. Yeah. But so it's not, it's a Dynamax, it's basically just a big version of itself. Yeah. But Gigantamax that's, that actually has a different form than the regular Trumple. Mm -hmm. It's pretty cool. I actually like the Dynamax thing mechanic a lot in Sword and Shield. It's really interesting. Megas were the best, though. Oh, absolutely. Mega Charizard is still, like, one of the, the best Megas out there. I like both Mega Mewtwo's, too. So. Mega Mewtwo's good, good. Design, absolutely. I like, them I like, I like the Mega Mewtwo's. I just think, uh, like, out of the Mega Starters, Mega Charizard just fucking cleans the, the slate, bro. I'm a big fan of Mega Swampert, too. Mega Swampert? That dude fucks. Tank. 
That dude fucks. Okay, Sandaconda. That's the rare of us. Primeape. Love Primeape. He's another one of my my. He's another one of my favorites from the originals. He's a really good OG fighting Pokemon. Oh yeah, because uh, he just he just hits hard as fuck. His base uh, special um, attack stats is fucking massive. Yeah, he has high speed. So you have special attacks. So you use any of the priority special attacks. His um, that have like a like you know a fast like uh, attack time. He beats them up with it. You know what I mean? Like, what are some of the special uh, fast attacks? Like, what's, what's the best one out there right now? Uh, I have no idea. I have no idea. Yeah, I can't remember which one, but if, if you're able to get a, uh, a Prime Ape with the special fast attack, he mops boards. Because his his, his special attack is, is one of the highest out there. I don't know if that's Dynamite punches. Punch Crow. Ooh, Salazzle. Not bad. A Salazzle haunting my dreams. <laughs> it do work. Hold it back to back to back. Do, it do work. Ooh, I already know there's going to be a heater in this one. Yeah? Yep. Smelt it? I smelt it. <laughs> I'm just like, mmm. Juice. Damn, so far, not bad hits though. Bouflant, level ball, Spupa, Pincho, Onyx, love Onyx. Oh, I got these in the, the case. Archer, sure. Alright, Licky Tongue. Foundling. Foundling is good though. He's not yeah, bad. Cool. I think he's one of the coolest design Pokemon. Yeah, game. like he, he he's good. I like the I like him. He's like he's like he's like the Doug Trio of like Sword and Shield. You know what I mean? Like he's, he's, he's multiple and everything like else. Execute, execute and armor. Yeah, exactly. Armor to execute. That's yeah. That's that's more. That's that's more on the money. Story, like I think six or seven. Though? It's six yeah, seven, yeah. Just like quite a few of them. Execute is one of those Pokemon I spent way too much time reading lore into mm -hmm. because I'm like, how can it work? How to how do egg Pokemon? Imagine like you have like a Pokemon egg, right? And your egg hatches and it's just more eggs. Right. Like, what's the re what's the reaction? What's the correct response? I guess you raise it. Ooh. 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 Nice. nice. Not bad. Oh, did I get another energy? Um, I think it's wrapped up. Okay, maybe I guess. I was gonna say that I get dub energy. Dub energy. Dub no, energy. I I, I I I search really hard. There's no way to search for it, but it's like miscut cards. I would love to. Oh, and Pokemon. Like oh, that'd be crazy. Wouldn't it? That would be crazy. I've seen some bizarre miscuts. I don't know how crazy they can get in this game, but like. The mis the miscut, the miscut. You know, I can't predict. It. Right. Really depends on how refined their their cutting processors are and everything else. I like, really good, I, I don't think you see it very often. Mad is just like, who cares? <laughs> yeah, you can tell with uh, Magic's cardboard quality. It goes up and goes up and down. Depending on product. Let's try Ruby. Charisu. Oh, nice. first fall hall of darkness. Ooh, Electrovire. I always like the. Uh, the Electabuzz and everything else. I just thought they were like good Pokemon in general. Because like out of all the types, my second favorite has to be like uh, Electric types. Just because like I like Electric types. So, I mean, it, it also stems from the fact that I thought like you know uh, Raikou was like one of my. Oh, yeah, sure. He's one of my favorite like he's cat Pokemon. Old target dog Pokemon, but like they, everyone just shits on them. Like yeah. you got a Suicune movie, you got an Entei movie. Entei's, like, and yeah, Entei is the head of the pack. Suicune like is like one of the most important legendaries, I guess. Crystal version. Yeah, exactly. The, game the whole game, like, okay, so like that that still bugs me though, because like you have like the the original Gen One, right? Gen One. You have the red version, blue version. Uh, you have well, yellow. Yellow is Pikachu. Yeah, and then green in Japan. So starter Pokemon's plus Pikachu. That's cool. Yeah, and then sense. silver and gold. You have Lugia and Ho. -Oh. And then we have Suicune. It's because the story was told, uh, like, Suicune was, like, the, um, 
main character in the plot line. Well, I get that. So, like, plot relevance. Understandable. Yeah. But, like, it just makes you feel bad for the other, like... And then all of a sudden, at the same time, and take out the movie. Yeah. So, Suikun got plot relevance. And take out the movie. Yeah. Raikou got shit on. Got shit on. And they also has a movie. He's, like, the, one of the main characters in the third movie. Yeah. Yeah. He, like, talks to Ash and stuff. Yeah. No. <laughs> So like, Out of all the legendaries, like, the only one that doesn't get any relevant time is Breaking. I bet he has like one anime episode. It's probably like, and, it, and, and he only shows up because they collected all three ca- oh, right, all three dog right. Pokemon. It's, it's like, oh, it, he sure. just he gets auto included yeah. because he's a part of the set. He's yeah. like the redheaded stepchild that like Pokemon doesn't want to recognize. Dude. Speaking of the original birds, though, uh, have you, have you seen the new Galarian? Altars? Yes. Like oh my lord! Dude, Chilling Rain. I'm that that those, that. I'm chasing those cards like crazy, dude. That's I need, set. I need the birds. I need, I need three birds. I need all three. All three altars. They are good. This cute guy. What's up? Dude, yeah, heater. He's got a lot of heaters actually in this box. It's like yeah, half the box. So we'll see. Fuck me. Steelix. I love doing some Steelix. I pulled the shiny Charizard Vmax. The DD. Yeah. Another electric. With the mega. Me- no, yeah, I'll show you a picture. It it should it, be it's it's like Anthem Max. Okay, that's okay. Yeah. With the fucking fire coming out of the side of his mouth like a horse. Oh, uh, I think so. A DD horse. Yeah, yeah I've yeah. seen that one. That's pretty cool. Dude, he's fucking beautiful. That's nice. Big fan. And I think you saw my post about the V unions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The the V unions. Oh, so cool. They're gonna be real hot money. So cool. Their mechanic is like super unique too. And I imagine I imagine there's gonna be parts of the V union that are more rare than the other ones based on Me like too. pool. I was like about to I was like I was like imagine like Mewtwo's left leg Ooh, is one of the Santa Scorch. Right? I hope Mewtwo's one. tail is the most important. Just this. <laughs> Just the tail. Just like it's kind of like how like the certain parts of Exodia OG, OG were like it's more important. Exodia. Yeah. The way the mechanic works yep. is um, you play it onto your bench and all four pieces on your discard. Yeah. So the goal is to pitch them into the graveyard and in modern Pokemon it's actually like really easy to do that. Mm-hmm. I find myself, I play Picaram online mm-hmm. and I find myself decking myself almost all, all the time. Nice. I set up my board and I either win or I deck myself. Right. So I, I could definitely be the union thing like super easy. Another mime. Me and show. Last pack. Last pack. Let's go. Put that juice early. Good stuff though. A lot of good stuff. Jellison. Yeah, different ones. Not bad. Not bad. All right. So, our money came out to be Steelix. Give you guys another check at that. True. Also, that cricket's going to be a piece also. But they don't really contribute any that. Oh, that is like gorgeous. Mm, that is just something else. And then. Oh yeah! Look at that look at the foil there. on that. It's crazy. It's really crazy. Big fan. 